Welcome back everybody to a new video here today. My name is Icy Advice and today we're checking out Installation 04 AI Battleground. Let's get right into it. Alright, so here we are on Installation 04. Now, today, as I said in the intro, we are checking out something absolutely incredible. This is Installation 04. AI Battleground. So, one thing I do recommend is that you have a handy dandy controller for this mod. Um, a lot of the button combinations, yes that's right, there is button combinations in this mod. A lot of them actually require a controller, or you can emulate a controller with a keyboard. I'm not entirely sure on how you actually do that, but there is a way to do that apparently. I've never done it before, so I can't tell you how to do it unfortunately. On screen here are the button combinations that you can use to be able to use this AI Battleground. You guys can put this in a document. You also, Seraphis, he also has it on his main mod page on the uh, the workshop. So there is that for you. I actually have it pulled up on my other monitor here to watch and look at what, you know, I would be using. Without further ado, let's go ahead and head into the Forge menu. So if we go ahead and press X here, you can see he has overhauled the appearance of the Forge menu, which in my opinion, this is a clean Forge menu. I like this Forge menu. So we got UNSC, male troopers, female troopers. We're going to go ahead and, and spawn all these guys in. We're going to go ahead and disable AI by doing left on the D-pad and holding A. And we also have trooper DMR and basically a ton of troopers armed with the base UNSC weaponry from Magnum, rocket launcher, shotgun, sniper, Spartan laser, etc. Same with the female troopers. We also have them all armed with the same exact weaponry as the male troopers. And then we also have sergeant troopers all armed with the exact same weaponry as well as we assemble our little assault force here. Same thing with ODSTs. They have all the same weapons as troopers. And ODST jetpack troopers, which in my opinion are definitely one of the coolest units of the mod. We have jetpack troopers. They can use jetpacks. Yes, that's very nice. Um, we also have Spartans that can use gravity hammers, energy swords, and machine gun turrets. So we'll spawn one with a machine gun turret and an energy sword. And next up we have custom Spartans. So this is all of the people that, um, that he chose to put in his mod, which I am in there. So shout out for Seraphacy right there. We can get him spawned in. We got Seraphacy there. We got Hazard. We got Spoopy. We got John117, so of course Master Beef. Then we also have myself with my sniper. We have Diamond Spider, we got Cursed, and we also got Spartan Rets up in there for the UNSC side. We also have Noble Team. We'll go ahead and spawn them on the front line. We got Carter, Cat, June, George, Emil, and Tom, which is, of course, Noble Six, but Noble Six before Noble Six. And then we also have some Civilians and Schism Firefight, or Schism Covenant, sorry, Wildlife and Respawning AI. And then we also have some miscellaneous, miscellaneous stuff. So like an Oni officer, we got Roland, and we also got Jonah. So we got some pretty cool Spartans here for the UNSC side. And if we go ahead and scroll up, we have some brand new weapons as well that we can check out. So if we go to human, we got some new, uh, not human, never mind, Covenant. So if we go ahead and go to the, uh, uh, the uh, Covenant side of things, we got an Elite, Minor, Officer, Ultra, General, and Spec Ops, Jetpack, Zealot, and last but not least, Field Marshal. And that completes all of the Elite. So a lot of them have like Plasma Rifles, Needler, Plasma Repeater, Needle Rifles. Some of them have Concussion Rifles, as you can see there, and etc, etc. We also got some Brutes, some Brute Miner, Captain, and of course a Chieftain. Grunts, we got a Miner, we got an Ultra, and we also have a Major, I missed the Major there. We have a heavy, and we also have a spec ops there. That is all of the grunts, and we also have, of course, our jackal, major, minor, and sniper there. Very nice indeed. We got skirmisher, minor, skirmisher, major, skirmisher, mumurio, commando, and champion for the skirmishers there. And then we also have the buggers. So we got a minor, major. Oh, that's a major as well. I guess we got two majors on the field here. Ultra. And that is all the buggers. We have a hunter. And then Deviant UNSC is basically traitors. We'll throw out a, a few Spartans there. Maybe an ODST there. So that is all of that. And we also have the Gouda and the MOA, which is absolutely incredible. We also have some respawning AI and miscellaneous, which is not available at the moment. He's planning on 
adding some new miscellaneous up in. We got a ton of AI in here, which is absolutely incredible. I mean, if you take a look at here, like we got some crazy amounts of AI up in here. I mean, it's actually insane. So if we go ahead and enable our AI, we can have a giant AI battle go down. And this just is absolutely incredible that we can do this in Halo Reach. I mean, it's insane. Go ahead and zoom in here. We got the the UNSC side fighting away. Oh, Gouda's going in there. What else we got? Oh my goodness. That elite just got freaking launched. Looks like we got some Spartans going up there. We got Carter going up there. We got an elite with or a Spartan with an energy sword. Everyone just charging in. This is just absolutely incredible. Do we have any? We got Tom and Rosenda back there. There's me. We got the AI going in here. A little bit of a situation here. Boom! Oh my god, he killed the ODST as well. Get in there. Get that Gouda. Oh, we got the Gouda. The UNSC side wins the fight. Congratulations, my friends. Very nice indeed. Oh yeah, also one other thing I want, forgot to mention is he has movable dead bodies. So if you go ahead and actually walk over these dead bodies, they will move. Which is pretty freaking cool. It's just insane what he's been able to do with this. And uh, yeah, that's going to be it for me, boys. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Of course, if you did, drop a like on it. Hit that subscribe button. That tells me that you guys enjoyed the video. And let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about this mod. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. My name is Icy Advice. And I'm signing out. Peace out.